Hello everyone, it is Thick Chick Vlogs, Thrifting Thick Chick, or whatever it is that you decide that you want to call me on today, okay? It is late at night, and honestly, I forgot to make this video, and when I realized that I forgot to make it, I was just going to make it next week, um, my thrift haul, because I did not pick up that many pieces from the thrift store this week, um, because a lot of the pieces that I put in my basket, I do like to see, that's one of the good reasons one of the good reasons. That's one of the reasons that you want to check the items that you pick up from the thrift store because a lot of times they have defects and all that type of stuff. And a couple of those pieces had like holes in them. And one of that, that uh, pink and black um, sweater dress that I had found, it had like a big grease stain on it. And I didn't see that initially when I picked it up. So a lot of the stuff that I picked up had defects and I put it back because it, you know, I don't really have time to try to be altering shit and stuff like that. And if you have not checked out the actual walkthrough where I actually take you guys through the thrift store with me, go and check out my main channel, Thick Chick Vlogs. I'll leave a link to my main channel. It's always in the description box. And you can go over and check out that um, actual thrifting adventure where I took you guys. You basically were following me around the thrift store. But anyway, this is going to kind of be like a fall, winter type of thrift haul because I did pick up mostly sweaters and stuff like that. But I did pick up a couple of pairs of um, leggings as well as some spandex and stuff like that that I can wear when I'm going walking. Because um, me and my girl, Miss New Life 808, we will be uh, walking together on Thursdays. I have a, a fitness channel that I'm going to start. It's not going to be anything major. It's pretty much just going to be we're going to be walking on Thursdays. And I'm going to be walking and talking. We were originally going to do that today. But, honey, it was 105 degrees here in Alabama. And, um... Thick Chick Vlogs was not trying to go out there and pass out and be in nobody ER on today, okay? So, we're going to go ahead and get started, okay? Because um, I'm already at two minutes and I ain't showed y'all a damn thing. So, let's go ahead and get started. And I do want to say that I did pick up more than um, clothing this time. Because you guys know I do go to the dirt cheap. And I found a couple of items over there. And I'm going to show you guys those things. A couple of these pieces I picked up. A couple of weeks ago but I didn't want to make this video and have like two or three items so I am showing you things that I've picked up over the last couple of weeks okay in the in the thrifting video that I did on yesterday I wanted I told you guys that I picked up an item that was like this this is basically like a um, kind of like I don't really know the type of material that it, that this is but um, it's really really flowy and it is a wrinkle type of material and that's actually how it is supposed to look okay and it is buttoned down there in the front. And I do like this. You can pair this with almost anything. You can pair it with some black slacks. You can play it, pair it with some jeans or something like that. You can put a black tank or something like that up under it. And you can just roll with it. And I do like the fact that it has that wrinkle type of um, feel to it. And that's actually how it's supposed to look. So I did pick that up. And as you guys know, I do not spend more. I don't like to spend more than $5 in the thrift store. But everything that I'm going to show you is probably going to be under $3. Or between... I say between four, four and four dollars and less. So um, I'll, I'm, I don't even remember how much I paid for this because I already washed it. But it was it had to be under four dollars because y'all know I'm. In order for me to be able to thrift like I like to thrift, I have to keep, you know, my budget at a certain level. Not that I don't have more than four dollars to spend on per piece, but in order for me to do this every week or every couple of days, I have to keep my budget at a certain. Um, level because uh, your girl is not rich even though this shit is scripted okay the next thing that I'm going to show you is this really really pretty gr this I was going to say gray this brown sweater it's not showing off the true color but this is a super duper cute sweater and I love the fact that it, it's kind of you can't really tell but it you can kind of see through it a little bit and the thing is this is so cute on me because it's kind of fitted and I like my jackets to be kind of fitted um, especially for the winter time because this is really cute because I'm a kind of a thicker girl and it's kind of you know if I have on something that's really really big it makes me look even bigger so I kind of like my sweaters and my my jackets and things to kind of be kind of fitted but this is really really pretty to wear for the fall I mean it's just super cute and it's by I'm not a label host so I really don't look at um names and stuff like that but it's by Kathy Lee okay but um I know I paid I want to say I paid two dollars and ninety nine cent for this sweater super cute and it has the buttons there down the front and it does have pockets here in the front if I'm not mistaken does it have pockets 
No, it doesn't have pockets, but it's cute either way. Super cute. So that's that piece. The next piece is this jacket. I showed you guys this in, was it this thrifting video? It was either this thrifting video or the last one. It's this jacket right here. Oh, I now, I love simplistic things, but I love the detailing on this. I don't know if you can kind of see that, but I love the detailing on that as well as here on the pocket. It has like that little buckle situation there and these are working pockets this is just a super cute jacket to wear with some jeans or anything like that for the fall and for the winter time with some um some heels or some boots or whatever just a really really cute jacket like i said i have i, I specifically went to the thrift store these last couple of weeks trying to find fall and winter jackets okay and i think this still has the tag on it and as you can see i paid two dollars and 99 cent for that okay and it says extra extra large this actually doesn't fit that that big it actually fits like a more like a large to me so it may be a petite or, or something like that I'm not really sure but that's super cute so I picked that up now this is something that I picked up a couple of weeks ago for a job interview that I told you guys that I was going on and it's this black blazer right here now this is a really cute blazer but I don't really like it, so I'm probably going to end up giving it away because it fits kind of big on me. And as I said, I really don't like my blazers and stuff like that to fit big on me. I like it to kind of be fitted. But um, this fits, it, it fits me, but it's kind of, it's a little too loose for my liking. But it's just a black blazer. Really simple. And these are working pockets here. And I really, really like here in the back, it has like the, kind of like the, I don't know what you call this, a tuxedo? Or do they make tuxedos like this? Those old time tuxedos? I can't really think of the name of it. But I love the fact that it has those buttons there in the back. And it is three quarter length sleeves. I mean, it's just really, really cute. But it's it's kind of big on me. And I don't like my blazers to fit big on me. So I'm going to probably give that away to someone. I don't know who yet. What size is it, by the way? It is a 22 women. I should have got no bigger than an 18 but I don't know why. I guess I needed a blazer for that particular day. And I ended up not going to the job interview. If you guys remember. Because I the Lord blessed me with another job. Like the day before that. So I ended up not going to that job interview. The next piece that I'm going to show you. I really, really, really love. I already have one of these types of sweaters. But I figured, you know, it was $1.99. So I had to get a second one, right? Not really, but I got it anyway. It's this right here. It's gray and black and I love the fact that it has the buttons there in the front yet again it does have a hood here on the back and it is kind of like a trench coat kind of sorta going up 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 <laughs> it's kind of like a trench coat and that's gonna be super duper cute for the fall and winter and it does have pockets here and it has a little button there on the pocket and these are pretty deep pockets so that's gonna be really really cute for the fall time and I think I pay I know I didn't pay no more than three dollars for this I want to say it was a dollar ninety nine cent as well and that's going to be super cute for the fall and winter look at that black and white kind of rustic type of situation yes haunted okay the next piece that I am going to show you is a cardigan that I'm going to wear like when it's not too cold outside and I just have on something. I just want to throw something on if it's kind of breezy or whatever. And it is this gray cardigan right here. I haven't washed this yet. All the pieces that you see that still have the, the, the stickers on them, I didn't wash yet. And as you can see, this right here was $2.99. And most of the stuff that I'm showing you with the prices on it, they were a certain percentage off. Because I do try to find the pieces that are a certain percentage off. So I'm pretty sure whatever I'm showing you had a percentage off of it. But um, this did have a percentage off, but I don't remember exactly what. But as you can see, it's just a regular cardigan. Like I said, I haven't washed it yet. And it's just really, really pretty and simple. Something to throw on with whatever I'm wearing. If it's just, you know, kind of windy outside, not too cold. Because it is a light um, sweater. Just really, really pretty and simplistic. And I love the fact that it's kind of, you know, um, where you can kind of wrap it and you can pin it if you want to or whatever. And it does have pockets here on the front. Super cute. So that is the next piece that I picked up. Next, um, I actually picked this up in the thrifting video that I did today or yesterday or whatever. If you haven't watched it, again, go and check out my main channel and check out that thrifting video. But I picked up this sweater dress right here. 
and it's just a um it's a dark gray sweater dress and i haven't washed this either because like i said i just picked this up yesterday and as you can see it was six dollars and 99 cents and i know you said i thought you said you didn't spend over five dollars for anything but this was actually 30 percent off so i didn't spend 6.99 for it but um and i think i got an additional 10 percent off because it was thrift week or something like that i showed you guys that in the beginning of the video as well it was thrift week but as you can see it is a gray sweater dress and it goes down pretty not too far, probably right below my knees, but I'm going to wear this with some black leggings and, um, you know, if I have to throw a jacket over it or whatever, because it is short sleeve and it does have the buttons here on the arm, which is super duper cute. So I'm definitely going to be rocking this for the fall and the winter with some boots and some, some leggings and things like that. I'm one of those types of people for the fall and the winter. I don't really put up my dresses and stuff like that. If it's a certain type of dress, I'll throw on some leggings with it, with some boots and um, a blazer or a jacket or something like that and I keep it pushing and it'll be just as cute as if you were wearing it with your legs out so I'm gonna throw this on with some leggings and a blazer if I have to and um, keep it moving but like I said I love these buttons here on the arm that is super duper cute and I love the fact that it has this um, duck bill neck what do you call this kind of neck I don't know but the scoop neck or whatever I love that as well now um, this piece that I'm gonna show you I actually did an outfit of the day with this but someone asked me to show them, um, cause they, I guess they thought I had wrapped it myself in my last outfit of the day video, but I didn't, it actually came wrapped like this. Um, so I didn't have to wrap it up, but I just wanted to show her exactly what it looked like on the hanger. As you can see, it's already wrapped. I didn't have to do it and it's just really, really pretty. And I think I only paid, it was less than five bucks. Okay. Like I said, I don't remember a lot of these prices because, like I said, this is something that I bought a while ago. But she just wanted to see how it was wrapped. And it's already wrapped and, it, and it's already sealed here up the, at the front. So I didn't have to, like, put any clips or anything in it. It's already sealed there and it's already wrapped for me. So pretty much I just had to put it on. And this is a very versatile dress. I can wear this in the fall and the winter. Um, well, maybe not the winter, but I can definitely wear it in the fall. Um... Or I can wear it in the winter too. See, it doesn't get that cold here in Alabama. So I probably can if I throw on some um, some uh, uh, stockings or something like that. Some flesh color stockings or something. Really, really pretty. I love this dress. It's really, really comfortable as well. Now, this next piece, I know you guys are going to say, girl, that is not fall or winter. But like I said, I love throwing leggings on with my pieces. Therefore, this is going to work perfect with a black blazer what I want you I want you to envision this okay I want you to envision it I want you to envision this with a black blazer a fitted black blazer maybe with some gold buttons or something like that with some black leggings and some high-waisted not high-waisted some uh, knee boots with some detailing or something like girl I just want you to envision it, okay but this is a it looks orange but this is actually to be honest with you, I maybe I'm colorblind. This may be orange, but it's probably coming up red on the thing. I can't really tell. It looks kind of orange to me. Um, it doesn't say here on the tag, but it looks orange in person, but it may be red. But shit, girl, I might be colorblind. But um, it's wrinkled because I did wash it. And it has the sleeves that are like this. But like I said, just envision this with a black blazer. Okay, envision it with a black blazer with some black leggings with some... Um, knee boots with some really really pretty jewelry and shit like that on it i think that'll be hot rocking it with some um leggings will pretty much bring out any kind of outfit and i know for a fact guess how much i paid for this one dollar i paid a dollar for this i couldn't leave that in the store for a dollar i can throw this on with some leggings and this is kind of it looks long but it's kind of short it comes up like right below the knee and it'll be just perfect for some leggings with some a blazer or something like that so that's why i picked that up and this is by uh asos curve Okay. All right. Now the next piece, I have no idea why I picked this shit up. I'm just going to be real with you. I have no earthly idea why I bought this, but I did. I'm probably, it's probably going to be something that I wear in the house. It's just a see-through purple type of situation. I don't know anything that I can wear with this. This is what the sleeves look like on this. Um, I, I don't know what the hell made me buy this. Because like I said, it is see-through. This looks like some shit that you probably wear at the pool or something with a bathing suit underneath it. Don't ask me why I bought this, but I did. Like I said, it's see-through or whatever. That's just, girl, nothing for real. Because I, I don't know what the hell I'm going to wear with this, okay? Don't know what the hell I'm going to wear with that. Okay, that is all that stuff. The next things that I am going to show you are leggings. These leggings that I picked up were brand spanking 
new okay most of them I did wash but there are a couple of pairs that I didn't just yet the first ones that I'm going to show you like I said they were all brand new and I paid a dollar for them okay it's gonna be these purple leggings right here and as I said me and my girl Miss New Life 808 shout out to my girl um, we are going to be going walking and uh, some of these I'm going to wear when I'm walking and some of them I'm, I'm going to pair with um, outfits or pieces that I already have and I'm going to use them um, as leggings underneath certain outfits. But anyway, these are just some purple um, stretch leggings and I love these. These are super comfy. Um, and like I said, I paid $1 for these and these are by Connection 18 Seamless or whatever, whatever, shit. But these are super cute and I paid $1 for these. The next ones that I'm going to show you are going to be these right here. Just some more simple leggings. And these are kind of like a purple, kind of like a light purple, purplish gray type of color. I'm not really sure, but these were $1 brand new. The next ones that I'm going to show you are these gray ones. Super cute. $1 brand spanking new. The next ones that I'm going to show you are these black ones, okay? Brand spanking new $1, just black leggings, okay? And these right here are, um, they're not really leggings. They're more so just like a, let me see what type of material this is because I don't want to lie, okay? These are 95% spandex or no, 95% cotton, 5% spandex. But they were super cute. I love the pattern on these and I did buy these on yesterday. As you can see, they were a dollar. These were a dollar 99 cent. These were not part of the leggings, but I just love the print on these, kind of like a snake print type of situation going on there. Really, really cute. Um, they're not tight enough personally to wear as leggings, but I can wear these when I am working out with my girl on Thursdays so I really really love them I love the fact that they're scratchy super comfy material okay super duper comfy material the next piece that I want to show you are these these right here are um what do they call these this is actually 95% nylon spandex or whatever and these buy these are authentic St. John's Bay and I love the fact that these are these things hold your um your stomach all the, the good that you got in Yes, they hold all the good that you got in. So, that's the reason why I picked these up. I'm going to wear these. Because, y'all, I got me a bike, y'all. Got me a bike. I don't know if I'm actually going to be riding it to the damn at the park. Because I can't I can't fit that shit in my car. I don't know what I got it for. Because I can't fit it in my car to take it to the park with me. I'm probably just going to be riding it around the neighborhood or whatever. But, I love that the fact that I can pull these up. Kind of high waisted and it kind of sucks in your damn stomach. Yes, honey. I paid... I want to say a dollar fifty cent for these. Super, super cute, and they are. They not. They scratchy, but they're like hold you in, girl. Because as you can see, yeah, hold your uh, good and things in. Now, this shirt that I'm going to show you guys. Okay, I already have a shirt that's exactly the same as this, but when I saw it, I had to buy me another one because it is super cute, and you never know when your other one might get a hole in it or it might start shrinking or whatever. But I had to pick this up, and it is not falling once. Okay, it's not falling once, but it's cute, it's sexy, and I had to pick it up. It's this shirt right here. It is a um, brown and black striped shirt, and I love it because it can show off my tattoo, girl. It can show off my tattoo. I mean, this is super sexy. If you're going on, out on a date night or something like that and you want to wear something super sexy, or you could throw a, um, a sweater on with this. And when you get to where you're going, just take it off and have it all, yeah, be extra sexy. Because it's warm in, 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 in the establishment, okay? It's just cold outside. You can be sexy inside, okay? You can be bundled up outside, sexy inside. But this is super cute. Super duper cute. Um, and like I said, I already have one exactly like this. But I saw another one and I had to pick it up because I just love it just that much. And I can show. I actually have a tattoo now that I can show off, girl. I got my shit. I went through the pain of getting this tattoo. I want to show it off. So that is super cute. And I know for a fact I pay $1 for this. Let me get up a close so you guys can see the color. And I already washed that, which is the reason why it doesn't have the tag on it now like i said the next few pieces are not going to be clothing so that is all the clothing that i got within the last two weeks or whatever 
but you guys know that I go to the thrift store and I like to pick up um, makeup bags and things like that all the time whenever they have them in stock and this particular day they had all of these things for 50 cent so I picked them up and I already have replicas of these but when you find makeup bags especially cute makeup bags for 50 cent I mean you be a fool not to go ahead and pick them up so I'm gonna go ahead and show you exactly what I got and I did got I did got I did get two purses so let me show you guys that as well one second okay one a second yes ma'am and yes girl okay the first bag that I'm gonna show you is this nine west um, type of clutch bag purse situation you can use this for almost anything especially if you're traveling or something like that and you have some makeup or something that you want to take with you super cute i love the bling on that it is gold and like like la, 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 la. talking over myself as you can see it's by nine west and i paid a dollar and 59 cent for this little clutch bag and it does have like a little handle here but um i would if this was something that i was going to carry around or whatever i would actually put it in my bag purse or whatever i'm carrying but it's just super cute i mean i couldn't leave that in there for $1.59 and I love like I said the bling bling detail situation on that now this next bag I'm not gonna wear this like I said I just have a huge purse collection and I got it because I don't know it was colorful okay and it's this bag right here and this is by nine and co or whatever and it was I paid it says $3.99 on there now it still has the Ross tag on here Ross dress for less apparently somebody donated it and it came from Ross they ain't never used it and it was $9.99 at Ross but I it says $3.99 on here but I remember distinctly that I paid $1.50 for this um but it has the authentic tag on there and look at what it says $50 so this is a $50 bag that I paid $1.50 for I don't know who the hell Nanako is but it has a $50 tag on it it has a $50 tag on it as you can see $50. It's still attached to the bag. They were selling it for $9.99 in Ross. And I guess somebody had it and they didn't use it. But they sold it. Well, they were selling it for $3.99 in the thrift store. But I got it for $1.50 because it was on. Yellow was one of the percentages off. So I got a $50 bag for $1.50. Go figure. I don't know what I'm going to wear this for. But I just. It was a $50 bag for $1.50. Shit. Okay. Don't, don't judge me. Okay. Now, I did pick up a couple of makeup bags from the dirt cheap i didn't get these from the thrift store the dirt cheap is a store that sells brand new things um for cheap prices but this is a sonia kashik um makeup bag as you can see sonia kashik i don't know if that's showing backwards or whatever but it's by sonia kashik shit shit sonia kashik and it is a brand new bag and I look, it has the gold things there on it as you can see brand spanking new and i paid 50 cent for this makeup bag okay Sonya Kashuk makeup bag the next thing that i got was this bag right here it's just a see-through bag for to put makeup and stuff in i'm not a huge makeup person but i do wear makeup and i do travel down my parents house and things like that plus i am going on a um vacation in the very very near future so i just wanted to pick up some make some more makeup bags and stuff like that i can give these away as gifts if my sister or somebody needs a makeup bag i can give this to her the next one that I picked up is this bag right here. I don't know who this is by. This is by, actually it's by Estee Lauder. This is by Estee Lauder. I don't know if you can see that. But that says Estee Lauder. And I paid 50 cents for this bag as well. And I love this little gold handle on here. Just super cute. And as I said, this is brand spanking new. And I actually, I thought, this, I thought I got this from the Dirty, but apparently I got this from the thrift store. It was $1.59. And it is yellow, and I remember I must have paid less for this, so I probably paid like around 50 cents for this Estee Lauder bag right here. Now, these last two pieces are not makeup related or anything, but I just thought they were cute and they were only 50 cents. And I can plaster them around somewhere in here, y'all. See, I like pink shit, and I like just having random shit just thrown all over the place. But it is these two pictures right here, they were 50 cents a piece. It says, why change? Everyone has her own style. When you have found it, you should stick to it. Now, that is super duper cute. Yes. And I got two of them because they were 50 cent a piece. And I'm going to put them somewhere. I don't know where yet, but somewhere. And that is going to end in my thrift store haul for the last two weeks i hope you guys enjoyed and um thumbs up this video for more thrift hauls and until the next time family make sure that you um go and check out my follow me around thrifting video on my main channel and until the next time i'll see you